Jeff Fox here, technology editor of Consumer Reports. We're at the hands-on now for the new Apple's new iPad. And there's all my books. Are these actual books that are already available, or is this just like? Because I, I you know. well, the store's not currently oh, it's up not and running just yet. But a hint, a hint of what we're yeah, going to get exactly. there. All right, so uh, take a look at. Uh, uh, just tap on the book, right? Mm -hmm. Is uh, Ted Kennedy's book. Again, you've got the little scrubber at the bottom. Oh, no. Click on the um, font icon. My eyes aren't as good as they used Click to be. Click on the little A. And then make it bigger or smaller. But how do I do that? Just hold, hold it? Uh, click it. Every time you click it, it gets larger so it keeps, until it gets to the it max. Keeps getting, it keeps getting a lot. And that's little, the maximum size. Oh, okay. And you can change the font by clicking on the font. So okay. this seems... Um, what do you think? Looking, looking at the text. I mean, so it looks brighter than a Kindle. The backlighting, all right, I, the backlighting looks, you know, seems brighter than a Kindle. I'm not trained to evaluate these things, but the text looks pretty crisp and sharp. Uh, and considering it's a touch screen, I don't see. Click to turn the page. Oh yeah. Yeah, exactly. So it kind of rolls. You can take a sneak preview of what what's coming now. I don't want to look. I don't want to see that, you know. And then we go this way, and you just get. Oh. Now, can you, I can switch this to a single page, single page view, or is it uh, always not in this orientation? Okay, but because I, if I find that uh, a little small, or that's as big as it gets. So it seems like certainly if you, if you had, you know, vision issues, you'd probably want to keep it in this orientation, one page at a time. Um, see about 20 lines here of text. I don't know the size of the text, um, but you know, it feels you know pretty comfortable. Thinner in the edges, it seems like easy to hold, you know, in the fingers. It seems very impressive. Um, seems like um, a cross between um, a MacBook, MacBook laptop, and an iPhone. Runs all the iPhone apps, and um, you, there's going to be a, a bookstore. A lot, you know, they're expanding, you know, the, the content that you can, uh, you know, download. Um, one thing that was surprising is that they're sticking with AT&T, although they seem to have some good plans. Um, we think competition is always better than one, one, you know, one provider, but we'll see, we'll, we'll see how that works out.